friends, it's Deborah. Welcome back to the channel. So this week I have my grocery haul. This is it for the week. I did a Walmart online pickup order and then I went to my local grocery store. I was going to go to Trader Joe's, but keep on watching to find out why I ended up not going to Trader Joe's and if you want to see what goodies I picked up this week. Hey friends, thanks for coming back to watch what goodies I picked up. So let's go ahead and talk about what I picked up. Most of my keto stuff is over there. We're going to start over here. Um, I only wanted to get a few things and there were some good sales going on. I did get one thing of bubbly and then one thing of water. We'll start right over here. I ended up getting my husband the chocolate Cheerios. He likes those. Um, his home style, some pulp, pulp Tropicana, his organic Valley 2% milk, some Hellman's mayonnaise. We were out. I got him some horseradish sauce and I got three of these for me um I try to get them like every other week and this will let I try to have like one a week now I know they don't have the cleanest ingredients guys please don't come at me I'm choosing the way to eat the way that I want to eat um I gave up a lot I gave up diet coke a week before I started keto it's been five months as of the 20th for my keto anniversary um, it was my keto anniversary, guys. 58 pounds down, so I'm doing something right. Um, so anyway, uh, I got my husband some creamy chicken and wild rice soup. Um, if you've been watching me, you know that I've bought some canned soups before, and I do say that I typically don't like to buy canned soups. So when the Panera is on sale, I'll pick it up for him. I got him some seeded hamburger buns because the hamburgers are on the menu this week. I bought one of these, even though my fridge has a, um, it has something built in that's like a, a filter for like smells. I still put one of these in there. Um, I got him his country Italian bread that he loves. The pineapples were on sale for $1.99, so I got him a pineapple. I got Bella a bag of her sweet potatoes. I got him some of his Tostitos. He likes the rounds. I got him one apple. Um, it's the, the cashier asked me too, and I couldn't remember. Apple crisp, honey crisp, honey crisp apples. Now that I don't eat them, I forget. <laughs> um, I got the Kerrygold, like, it's like softer. It's not really soft, soft for my husband's um, toast. And then I got the regular, I always like to get the unsalted. I'll pay a little bit more. I, that's why you never see me haul it from Costco, because I like the unsalted. Um, the two good, they were on sale four for five, so I ended up getting four. I got two of the blueberry, two of the mixed berry, and one of the strawberry. I picked up a five-pound bag of regular potatoes to keep in the pantry for my husband. Avocados were on sale, four for five dollars, so I picked that up. Cucumbers were on sale, two for a buck, so I definitely picked that up. I picked up one package of Italian sausage. I've been having a taste for sausage. So we'll have sausage and peppers this week for dinner. And then for Mexican night, I have uh, some skirt steak. So we'll make that skirt steak this week. Shreds, you know, guys always know that I get that. Um, my husband likes it for his like, sandwiches. Tacos, I picked up radishes because I really like them fried up like potatoes. I just fry them up, put some jalapeno, some onion. If you follow me on Instagram, you'll know that. I picked up some eggs. Um, their cheeses were on sale for $1.88, so I picked up the Mexican blend because I'm not going to Costco, or I'm not going to Trader Joe's this week because I really don't need anything. What I was going to go for, I ended up finding at my local grocery store. Um, the bar chunks were on sale, limit four for $1.88, so I got two of the sharp cheddar, one Colby Jack, and then one pepper jack. Um, this I got for convenience because it's already shredded. I did pick up uh, one package of the beef. These were actually, there was a coupon for, this was $1.88 and it was $1.50 off if you bought one of these and two of these. I was already gonna buy cream cheese because they were on sale three for five. So this came out to, what did I say? like 38 cents 33 cents or 38 cents whatever so not bad i picked up some strawberries because i've had a taste for strawberries some um, mozzarella some cilantro 
So I also picked up some salmon. I paid a little bit less than the one from Trader Joe's. Or I think Trader Joe's was maybe a little bit less than a dollar. But it's pretty much the same thing. Um, my Trader Joe's is about 20, 25 minutes away. My local grocery store is 10. So I'll save it in gas, right? I ended up buying the 50-50 mix for my sales this week. Um, I My husband wanted some roast beef. So I went with the same brand. It's called Green Ridge Farm. Um, this is the roast beef. It's a little pricey, but it's, you know, no MSG, no added fillers, no nitrates, no nitrates. So I got a pound of the roast beef. That's why I got that horseradish sauce. And then a pound of the cheddar. And then I, we could use that on the burgers as well. One package of blueberries. Because I think I want to make pancakes this week. My little cherubs. I really like those on anything. On anything. Um, I picked up the 4505 chicharrones. I wanted the jalapeno ones, but they didn't have any. They were all out. So um, I still have one bag of this classic chili and salt one. So I just picked up another one. Um, a bag of lemons because I like lemon with everything. Bag of onions because I needed onions. A three pack of peppers because that is for the sausages. One thing of Downy Unstoppables, I didn't pick up a huge size because I do need to get to Costco, that's for sure. Next week, for sure, I am going to fly to Costco um, and pick up some things that I want for the house, some paper plates. I picked up some Ritz crackers for the pantry for my husband. I uh, picked up some Cheetos because they were on super cheap sale at uh, Walmart. Some oyster crackers, I just like having these in the pantry for my husband for his soups. My nieces come and they just like eating these plain right out of the bag um i picked them up some Utz potato chips and then one screaming sicilian pizza just the pepperoni and that is it if you're on keto keep strong keto strong if not i hope you enjoy either way i hope you enjoyed my haul thank you guys so much for coming back and spending some time with me if you're new here i would love for you to consider subscribing and I will definitely catch you All right, friends. So here we go. We're going to start off my meal plan for the week. Let me just show you. Sorry about that. I got to remember not to slam on it because then the whole table moves. What I do is um, the week before, I do check off every meal that I had planned to make. Um, I just make sure that I made it. If not, I can carry it over for the, to the next week. So, and last week I made everything that was on the meal plan. Um, Friday was homemade pizza, Saturday was out, Sunday we were out again by my in-laws. So I only cooked um, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. So anyway, so this week, here we go. Here we go on Monday the 25th, last night we had salmon. I made a big, big salad and asparagus. Yesterday wasn't a great day for me. I gained a few ounces. Um, the salmon was pretty much all I ate besides snacks. I was very snacky yesterday for some reason. And it's so weird because I hardly ever snack. So I was snacking on like Lily's chocolate. I had um, a package of the fat snacks, the lemon crackers or cookies. And then I had, um, what else did I have? Oh, nuts, macadamia nuts um, and a couple of almonds. No, pecans, pecans. So it's weird that I was snacking, but I think it's because I'm not intermittent fasting. I usually take take the weekends off from fasting. So um, I'm saying I didn't have all my fats in. Um, Tuesday today, we are going to have carne asada using skirt steak. I have a cook with me on that. So I will link it here. I'm just making some roasted peppers and onions and jalapenos to go with it and then some guacamole wednesday i'm making burgers with jicama fries if you follow me on instagram you know that i already made some last week and they were so delicious i have jicama and i do have um i have jicama and i do have radishes that i can make it with as well and then thursday we're having crock pot butter chicken butter garlic chicken oh my gosh i saw a recipe on pinterest and it looks amazing i have to tweak it because i don't like cooking in the crock pot because i have an old school crock pot and it doesn't like 
sear the meat. So I'm gonna have to tweak the recipe a little bit, like sear the meat and then put the chicken in the crock pot. <clears throat> Excuse me. Friday is my mom's birthday. I don't think she's coming over. I think she's coming over, but not till late. <clears throat> I'm, I apologize. I don't think she's coming over till like nine o'clock at night, Friday. Um, so we're just gonna be making homemade pizzas. As always, my husband loves pizza. And then I just make my little fat head dough. Sometimes I don't even do that. Sometimes I just have uh, some sausage with some marinara sauce and some cheese and I'm good with that. Or sometimes I'll make the Quest pizzas. Um, Saturday, we are definitely going out for my mom's birthday, so I'm not cooking Saturday. I try to take at least one to two days off a week, at least one. Um, and it looks like this week, I'll only have one day off because Sunday I am making, I'm hosting a brunch for my mom <clears throat> and I am serving Mexican pozole. I've made that before and the only thing I do is I don't eat the hominy, so it's keto friendly. Um, it's also my niece's 10th birthday. She's having a party on Saturday. I'm not sure if her mom's doing anything Sunday with the family. If not, I will catch her during the week and drop off her gift at her house. But yeah, that is this week's plan. Um, pretty simple. If you want, I will do a cook with me on this crock pot butter garlic chicken. Um, it's a garlic it's a butter garlic lemon chicken. Oh, it just, it looks so freaking delicious. I can't wait to make that. I wanted to make that Wednesday, but I figure because of the buns staying fresh, I would definitely um, get the burgers in earlier in the week. So that is my meal plan. Comment down below. Let me know if you want it if you want me to do any of these cook with me's. But I am definitely going to do this one. I think you guys would enjoy this one. Um, thanks guys. Thanks so much for watching. I do appreciate your time with me and I will definitely catch you at the next one.